Uh, we're talking about the best Keurig <coughs> espresso pods. Pete's Pods, official come Pete, down. Is this a premium episode? Premium. so, yes. It is. Okay, well then, fuck Pete's. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck them, actually, is what I think. It's like, the coffee's very good. I got the other cheap, I got the biggest, cheapest ones you could get off Amazon. Them shits weren't good. Does Amazon make their own? No. No, I don't think so, but soon. Have you seen those, like, Amazon Twitters that are like, they actually, we can piss as much as we want here. Whenever what? someone tweets about Amazon being bad, uh-huh. Amazon's hired, like, random motherfuckers who work, like, they pay them extra to be like, or it's bots, I don't know. And they're like, actually, Amazon's really a cool place to work. <laughs> it's fucking crazy. Wait, dude. they said that they're, they're allowed to piss wherever they want? Well, when people are like, Amazon... They won't let you take a piss. They're like, wow, that's crazy that that happened at that one place. Where I work, we get to shit, our, shit all day. It's oh, just they like, like pose as like fake employees. Yeah, or they are, or whatever. They're real ones that they pay. Who cares? But yeah. it's fucking weird, dude. I would like to have those Twitter accounts for women that I fucked. Actually, Sarah sticks me good. Actually, fucked good. And he, his, his hamstrings didn't cramp up while he was on top. Yeah, that happens to you? <laughs> hamstrings? Sometimes. Really? Damn, your body sucks. You I pull mean, a hamstring? I have fucking? in the past. Oh. I, one time, I, I was I, at my absolute fattest, I blew my own back out. <laughs> Where? <laughs> either, when you're that fat, <laughs> you could just blow your own back out fucking. That's right. You don't need these women. You can bl- blow your I'll, own. I'll blow my own back out. Blow <laughs> your own <laughs> damn back out. <laughs> you don't need to let these demons tell you what... Mm-hmm. Well, the thing you, you guys aren't thinking do. about is that I also have to be cognizant of the weight distribution. So I can't really just... So if you go in full inertia, full mass, the girl could... She'll sp- like explode through the wall. Pink mist. Well, you have to consider <laughs> <instead>. <laughs> <laughs> like is that I'm, bad, I'm, I'm really bad at fucking in many different ways. <laughs> no. I, w- also, I'm not only am I too fat just in terms of my, my flexibility. That's the only way. But I'm also too... F- I crush people because... That's, of, that's, that is... Uh, to be expected when you're too fat flexibly. So that's not really a separate category. That's all under the umbrella of too fat. Thank uh-huh. you very much. But you have to slow your momentum at a particular time so, so as to when you like go full dick into yes, the pussy. Yes, and that's when the hamstrings are kind of like a shock absorber. Uh-huh. They but I feel like back. at a certain point it's like a mus- muscle memory kind of thing. Yes, yeah, sure. This isn't, <coughs> it doesn't typically happen to me when mm-hmm. I'm extra fat and extra don't have sex. Which I'm not either of those <laughs> anymore. Thank you very much. He's both of them. <laughs> <He's> both. <laughs> no. <laughs> from from a, a mile Fuck. and a half away, <laughs> Chris Kyle has him in his sights. Actually, it's you. <laughs> Actually, that is you. Uh, fuck. <clears throat> Damn, I'm fucking tired. You've been in the fuck. You've been fucking processing dude, orders, dude. I sent out. Something like twelve hundred T-shirts, wow! In five days, damn! And then you don't know, you can't tell if the orders are fucked up until you get to the end, because I sold out of everything. So you're not aware of like when things get fucked up until oh, right. it's like the last like seven orders, and then somebody needs this <coughs> size and it's gone. Or and you're like, I sent it to someone else. Yeah, or you're supposed to be sold out of something, and there's still like two of them sitting there. Uh huh. Um, so there's like. There's like six shirts left that I shouldn't have, which means that probably somewhere around eight orders got fucked up. Nice. But out of a thousand, that's not like bad. That's yeah, less that's than a one percent failure rate. You, way less. Yeah. No, not. What's a thousand? Thou- ten, ten, ten orders would fucked be up 1%. would be one percent. So, so it's not way less. Oh, well, it's, it's slightly less, less slightly than, less. than a one percent failure rate. Bitch. I just okay. remember one time we talked about some math thing. It's happened a couple times. And I don't remember what it is, but I've been the only one that's right. Oh, when we did mean. No, let's not do that time. again. In a different time. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, um, well, well, you're good at numbers because menus have numbers on them. <laughs> not all of true. them do. That's why. No. <laughs> if anything, they you're, have you're, much you're, more your mind, words than Your numbers. mind is thinking in terms of, like, let me get number six. That's a fast with food With extra menu. size. 
extra. So let me get uh-huh. a super size number six. So you're thinking they don't even X do bonus. super size anymore. See, this is what I mean. It's because <laughs> this they don't do don't super size anymore. No, you know exponents. You know exponents. I don't know menu. exponents. There's no exponents on the menu. <laughs> <laughs> super sizing would be an exponent. <laughs> oh, I guess that's number true. six. Super size is actually an eight eight point seven. That's not what an exponent but is. But you see all you just see numbers. <laughs> an exponent's like a, something squared. You're right? like Neo instead of you just see like power. all the different calories and stuff when you look around. Like if you're like if I ate that blonde woman, I'd gain <laughs> four hundred and eighty three pounds. <laughs> no, I don't know any of that. I'm more I just go by feel. Yeah. yeah. I'm like uh I'm like uh, Morpheus. Oh, so you, you feel I think. I don't remember the matrix. But Neo knows more than Morpheus. Doesn't Morpheus teach him how to... Yeah, but then he surpasses him quickly. Yeah. I think. The student becomes the master. The student you know? becomes the master. Yeah. That's awesome. I love when that happens in uh, literature and film. <clears throat> yeah, in life in general. What have you been up to, Adam? Um, nothing much. Yeah, you know, just living the fucking dream, <laughs> baby. No, I've been good. Do you have a man cave now? Um. Oh yeah, I got a man cave inside <laughs> of a man cave. No, I have various compartments within my man cave. It would be awesome if we went to your house and it was just like a lazy two lazy boys next to each other. Actually, just friends. friends. The friends. Yeah. Layout. Yeah, just me and the dog and the lazy boy. Mm-hmm. Watching cute. Baywatch. Yeah, you could just watch real porn. Nah, Have dude. we talked about this before? In Probably. The, yeah. Just getting horny with your boy. To, I love that. To Yasmin Bleeth. Was she on the show? You guys must have beat yeah, off. Well, there's it. no way that entire <coughs> writing staff of that show wasn't like ancient gay Jewish men. Yeah, it's yeah exactly. sure. I think the, the creator yeah. was... What if like they, they hang Jewish out guy. in New York together and they have a good time? <laughs> <laughs> oh, and Chandler, he's, he does sarcasm. <laughs> <laughs> what are we doing for lunch? <laughs> Is it cum again? <laughs> <laughs> Can we have cum? Uh, uh, Diane, let, let, let's, we'll go around and do the orders for lunch. I want a cum salad. <laughs> Can you? Is it? Do they have the soy lettuce? <laughs> I want the fake lettuce made out of pressed fermented soy with the cum dressing, but light, <laughs> light. I'm on, on a the diet. side. On Just the side. A little bit of watered down cum on the side <laughs> for my fermented soy lettuce salad with acai berries and mm-hmm. cum nuts. <laughs> That sounds good. They bake the cum, and it's a substitute nut made out of watered down cum. <laughs> Oh, so they water it down and then dehydrate it. I've been doing a detox. I only eat cum, <laughs> and I feel a million years younger. <laughs> Look at this. Look at you can see all the veins in my ass. <laughs> That's how I know I'm in good shape when I've completely atrophied my ass muscles to the point where you can see veins over bone, and that means I'm in. Oh, right. So Joey and Chandler. <laughs> You know, they're a couple of straight so Ross guys. Gets a gay, monkey. You know how gay guys or straight guys are. They hang out in an apartment and watch Baywatch yeah. together. <laughs> That's a regular straight guy kind of thing to do. It honestly would be hilarious if they wrote that show now. Uh-huh. And, and, like, they thought that straight guys sat around watching Baywatch. Like, <laughs> the show from 30 years ago. They're like, wait, oh man, I can't wait to see girls in bikinis. <laughs> it's not even bikinis. It's one piece. It's one piece. Yeah, it's less sexual than Latin American children's television. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> <laughs> man, uh, Sabado Gigante... Yeah, they got ladies with big ass titties. Yeah, now, that's they, not the Gigante la- were the titties, dude. That's right. That's not children's television, but I would like to see a clown fuck a lady with big titties. Yeah, I always was wondering. <laughs> if I the think clown- the clown's <laughs> trying to rape them the whole time. Yeah, if the clown that's ever like got, got, got his nut, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <laughs> the mu- muñeca, the little, the little fool, you know, it's Is that a sixty-year-old fat man, a muñeca. I think a muñeca is a clown or a doll, maybe. Muni means pussy in Greek. Well, it's the same language, Spanish and Greek. No, very different. Both very passionate, but very different. Uh-huh. But, um... All right. Sorry about that. Adam accidentally admitted that he looked at child pornography. 
Well, now you repeated Fuck. it. Yeah, but I didn't say on, I didn't say on. what kind. We'll edit it. Well, let's record over. I, everyone knows. <laughs> everyone knows yeah. you look at child pornography, but what we're cutting out is this the ebony. The the, the, <laughs> the, the ebony horrifically. Child <laughs> <porn>. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's just toddlers with huge dicks. <laughs> just fucking grown women. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're fucking they're fucking forty two year old women. Yeah, but they're just young boys with just there, nine there, and a half. There goes shorty, work is shorty. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, baby. <laughs> Go on, work for now. Yeah, the pacifier. In the One of my everyone friends. just looks at a pedophile and they think, "Oh, you'll take any kid." But pedophiles have taste. They do know? have taste. Yeah, just j- like Jeffrey Epstein bent over with a ball gag in his mouth and like <laughs> these w- extremely rare toddlers he has flown in from, <laughs> from Africa just yeah. fucking him in the ass. He's a wealthy man. <laughs> yeah, punish me. Those boys make a good living, dude. They're they're, they're like You got to go into niche. They're deities yeah. in the, from where they're that's from. That's the way to yeah. make it in this industry these days is you have to cater to a niche audience yeah, that will like, pay. That's my religion. <laughs> <laughs> that's what the temple's about. That's what the temple's Big dick toddlers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, one of my friends that I, w- that I played football with, uh, uh, a, a black gentleman, said that when he was like nine, an old lady uh, raped him, essentially. And I believe him. He was like not. He wasn't like trying to brag. It was like people were talking about how they fucked when they were like young as a joke. They're like, uh-huh. yeah, I-, I had sex when I was eight years, like just joking. Yeah. And he was like, what about you? And he was like nine and he had like this <laughs> just like <laughs> he was like staring he off into the distance he wasn't bragging he was not bragging and we yeah. were like what ha <laughs> for real he was like yeah and then he just like solemnly told the story of like this old lady saying she needed help like I don't know, uh-huh. like with a chore or something, and her riding his little ass dick, oh his God. little boy's dick, and that's and he was and everyone was like, it really, I gotta say, killed the mood at football practice. Yeah, because we were all talking about fucking when we were eleven as a joke. It was a real towel snappy kind of conversation. It was a very towel snappy conversation, and then he really and then had he, to bring it down with that rape. He told, he told the very, <laughs> and he was really good at football too. I won't say his name. I don't want to dox him. He's but been running from it ever since. He's you know? been, yep. He was a defensive back. Vinny's, <laughs> Vinny's getting too excited about his Comp Town appearance. Was huh? that? Vinny's getting too excited about his Comp Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's <laughs> he, gonna, texts he, me, he texts me after his set at Funny Moms. He's like, bro, my li- you changed my life. <laughs> 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 he texts me after his set at Funny Moms. He said, best day of my life. <laughs> 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 oh, Nick, you should have seen that. That's set. awesome. I just like to imagine him at Disney World, and he's talking to Goofy, and he's like, bro, we can work together. <laughs> like, like, honestly, meeting you, this is one of the greatest moments of my life. And we can work together, <laughs> and we're going we're gonna to do a tour. <laughs> what is it's it? It's just some Hispanic guy <laughs> that is like, eh, no, no, se, no, no, the end. He's like, what the fuck? The guy no, shows no, up no, for no, the no, first no. tour. Yeah, right. What the fuck is this? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know you guys thought you were going to see Goofy, but we got Bam Margera <laughs> instead. <laughs> it's a bunch of four-year-olds. <laughs> And he's like, look, my dick looks like a tuna can. He's pulling his penis out in front of all the kids. And then the mother's like, well, I would expect this at the E. Jean Carroll show, but not the Goofy show. Oh, fuck. Oh, man. Yeah, salute <coughs> to the sexual fantasies. <laughs> salute to Big Vin, dude. Yeah. What is it about? Because he's objectively a bad, morally bad mm-hmm. person. Yeah. You know, but it's I refreshing say, that he's honest about how bad he is. What no. makes what makes a character like that like at least palatable? Charisma. Charisma? He does he's have not a weird that charismatic. Yeah, but see people like don't understand what charisma is. They think it's like just fit like the, there are people that are like Donald Trump is extremely fucking charismatic right. and yeah. that's why he's president. People think charm and, and charisma a bad person. is the same they, thing. They exactly they think it's like because Barack Obama is charismatic, but Donald Trump is similarly similarly charismatic. Maybe more like Vinny's not charming, but he yeah, is he's charismatic. not charming, but he's very charismatic. He's a good salesman. Uh-huh. He's, he's, he he's does a, have a little glint in his eye. That's I will the kind say. of guy you <laughs> like. You know, he talks about selling used cars. It's like you didn't sell those cars because he got one over on those people it's because they felt bad for him because he's a pathetic guy and they're like all right i'll buy this shitty car i'll buy this shitty he's selling girl scout cookies in the form of like a fucking you know Uh actually i like girl scout cookies i love them you know what he's selling is that like uh what is that the gift wrap company 
I never. And so, like, they make kids sell, like, gift wrap. Oh, that was never a thing. We always did chocolate bars. Or chocolate bars or, you know, like yeah. any, like forks. Like, we talked yeah, about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's Cut what cow. Vinny's doing. But as an adult, he's like, yeah, I'm selling Bam Margera for my school. Right. And they're like, oh, this this retarded school is <laughs> selling tickets to a Bam Margera redemption <laughs> tour. Uh, yes, I get, me and my husband, Larry, will spend $80 a piece. Uh, let me just get my checkbook for the, a piss hot tub, you say. Oh. <laughs> And your your name is oh Vinny, and you're how you're 32 years old and a half. That's that's nice. That's very nice, Mr. Vinny. Here's your check. Oh man. Yeah, he's 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 charismatic in a, in a way that yeah. You, you yeah, because you think a salesman is like can alpha you, but he can also do the opposite. I guess the worst kind of person is someone that's bad, a bad person, but wants everyone to think they're a good person. Yeah. Right. Then everyone's like, there's You're something nice about a bad person that is like, I'm a bad person. I will rip off your social security. <laughs> yeah. You're like, damn, you just came out there and said it? There's some honesty there. Yeah. Sure. It's like people hate Tiger Woods because everyone thought he was a good guy. Yeah. Not because the, he fucked a bunch of waitresses, but it's because they felt lied to. Right. You know? I don't hate him, personally. I love him for that. Who? I love him for that, too. Tiger Woods for getting Waffle House pussy. Oh. On pills. Shouts out John Daly also. Another guy. Legend. Legend. Marlboro Lights and fucking Diet Coke, dude. <laughs> all day. <laughs> I love Diet Soda now. Are you on the Diet Soda kick? You're on the Yeah, Aspen. I got to get some straws for home, too. I'm going to start drinking. I had a, a straw and a can of soda the other day, and it was like, wow, this is great. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you mean. I only do that when I get pizza because they give you the straw with the soda. Yeah. Well, I got this. I got a giant mustache now, so anything I true. Eat, yeah, I get okay like a, a sausage egg and cheese sandwich from the bodega in the morning, and I look in the mirror afterwards, and it's like, oh god damn. You have an omelet. I in, look on like your Garfield. Mouth. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> my whole face is orange. Damn, pussy eating whiskers. True pussy eating whiskers. Yeah. Uh, pussy, pussy, pee pee. Pussy papa pee 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 poo poo. Yeah, I actually I think that drinking through a straw is like a way more pleasant experience than straight from a cup. I like the can. I like putting my dirty at my mouth on that dirty ass can, dude. It feels like I'm raw dogging. You uh-huh. guys are using condoms, not me, dude. Mouth right to the hole. Yeah, well, you don't have a mustache. I have a little bit of a mustache. Yeah, but not something like this. Sure. Yeah, this is a nightmare. Not something so unruly. Uh-huh. Why don't you just trim the Yosemite mustache Sam? part? Why don't you mind your own damn? <laughs> All right, I'm sorry for asking. I'm sorry for asking. I'm clearly no damn, beard. Dude, I'm never expert. gonna have a fucking thick ass beard. Are I you smoking pipes rosy back? Rosy ass on? cheeks. No, that's from like two or three years ago. I'm cleaning out all my shit. That was the pipe I used for like a month. I remember in that windowless room. <laughs> Hand it to me. Let's see how I look with the beard and the pipe. Dude, yeah, you gotta this is start the smoke, look, Nick. Smoking a pipe. This is what you gotta start doing. Start oh my god, you look like a sea captain. Oh yeah, there you go. That's right. Yeah, your beard was patchier when you smoked that thing. Yeah. Now it's nice and full. Well, it's like, That's what, a great 20, look, dude. 24? You look like a Confederate I'm th- I'm general. Th- I'm 30 now. That wasn't 24. 24, 25, yeah. Really? Yeah. Damn, dude, we're I dying. Guess it w- we've been in New York for so <laughs> long. It feels like I've lived in New York for two years. <laughs> I know. We've been here for like five years. I don't know. I was driving through Chinatown yesterday, uh-huh. and uh, it like hit me how long I've been here. So long. Because that was a long time ago. I, yeah. I drove past that Whole Foods on Houston, and I used to, because I didn't have internet at my place, so I'd write, <laughs> I would write articles in the morning mm-hmm. and then walk either to Dunkin' Donuts or sometimes to Whole Foods if I wanted like a more sprightly walk. I've seen some live-ass shit happen in that food court in that Whole Foods. Oh, yeah, the food court was great. One time I was just trying to email stuff off, and there was some guy with like a shitty mohawk. He was, he was like Russia. He was Ukrainian. Uh-huh. And he was with this old Russian guy that was just fucking checked out, you know, like <laughs> no English. Yeah. And then he's like, he's like, yeah, I'm um, looking for some cool stuff to do, you know. <laughs> I go back to Ukraine like uh, two days. <laughs> and so he's just some fucking Ukrainian moron. He's probably like 18. And he's like, I'm going to go to New York. And then he like hung out in the Whole Foods <laughs> Food court with his retarded Russian <laughs> uncle. And I was like talking to him. I was like, "Oh, cool, man. Yeah, no, New, York, New York's great." <laughs> yeah, it's so funny because Whole Foods is like their aesthetic is like fancy suburban mom, but if you put it in the middle of Manhattan, like. 
pee smelling homeless people are gonna just gravitate to mm-hmm. that to that food court. That's like good you shit. can't you can't stop it from. I miss it. I, know, I love a nice. Maybe I should get a. Maybe I should court. retire this pipe. You want it, Adam? No. Why? I don't want. I don't smoke pipes. Yeah, you could get into it. I smoke. I smoke bowls. I you know. Get a, I get a meerschaum pipe instead. Oh yeah. What's that? I the know, big ones? The white ones, like those ebony ass pipes. Oh, yeah, yeah made I, out of I, I, the ivory. ivory. Carved the out ebony. of an elephant's tusk. You got ebony on your mind ebony. now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got those, that ebony toddler porn on your mind, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see what I'm here, Sean. Ebony. Just and wearing a baby ivory. pair of Jordans. <laughs> 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 Huge dick, yeah. fucking adult woman. I can't wait to ju- dress my child in I baby Jordans. I love it. Just yeah. baby shoes that cost a hundred dollars. <laughs> this shit. All right. Uh, oh damn. Let me see. Is it yep. like selling <laughs> ivory <laughs> illegal now? So what, dude? What or are you, a maybe it's just bitch? killing yeah, it's not, elephants. It's not ivory. It's meerschaum. Oh, that oh, just I thought you like were making fun of an uh, Indian man. Yeah. No, it's sea foam. It floats on the Black Sea, and then you, you they like turn it into a pipe somehow oh no they I make want foam ivory. into a hard rigid substance yeah i want ivory wow. dude i want i want tusks dude it's really sad that they do that dude, like poaching is... shit makes me really sad yeah that is sad this is sick this is on amazon is there any is there any uh natural it's only 40 dollars you can get this <laughs> dude get it right now what are you yeah. waiting for uh um, instant buy my my better judgment to kick Buy in. with one click. Yeah. No, no, not enough time. Fuck your better judgment. Yeah. One click is really... Wait, you know what's cool, it's too? It's a is problem. It's the, a problem. The, 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 the watch, night watchmen, I forget what they're called. They're like uh, like churchyard pipes. Mm. And they're just like these giant fucking pipes that are for Supposed like... Supposed to go all night? Well, it's for, yeah, for the guys that work like the graveyard shift. Mm-hmm. Um, here, night watch... I don't. Think I feel that, like I don't think that was what it's called. It's you guys ever get extra itchy balls? Uh, no, never. I had sex uh, recently with a real fire asshole. Nice. My my butt was just. I didn't do that extra wipe, and it. I could. Tell oh, you had a shitty ass. It wasn't shitty, but it was, it was itching. Like, it was itchy as fuck. Did it affect how hard you got? No. Church warden. <laughs> That's what they're called. Were you on blue chews? No, Natch. be honest, Natch. But I did just get uh, a subscription. Shipment. Yeah, we'll save it for Not the regular. Not a subscription. We'll save it for the regular. Yeah, we should talk about that. <laughs> we yeah. don't talk about dick posts for like next to it. Oh yeah. yeah, just so I could booze hard Can and you imagine, it's like, you know, imagine me with a pipe like that. Damn, that is you a have type to, pipe. dude. It's like, well, what's the sca- style gonna be though? Are you gonna dress like no, fucking like the, no, Sherlock? The same exact way I do. Now. No, if you're you like change. If you're getting drunk and like. Randomly Avenge seven fold shirt <laughs> in the pipe. <laughs> and, <I'm laughs> yeah, and a three foot long so pipe. Fourteen inch <laughs> Indian spirit. <laughs> that would make no Just sense. Just showing up to the stand and be like, no, nah, no, nah, I don't I don't do spots anymore. <laughs> Just having a, a pizza. Yeah. <laughs> no. Nah, no, nah, I don't really do stand up anymore. <laughs> no, nah, I'm I'm just uh no, I'm just chilling. Just chill. Just here to smoke the pipe. I'm just here trying to smoke my Next damn. to Berg smoking a cigar, you got that giant pipe. <laughs> 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 no, nah, I'm fuck. I'm normal. I'm just a cool guy, I'm man. I'm just a guy that likes to enjoy a piece of pipe <laughs> here and there. Damn. Oh, it's a Gandalf pipe. Gandalf? <laughs> Is that what it's called? It, no, it's called the Church Warden pipe. Maybe if you were thinking about anything. No, you said it's a Gandalf pipe. I, yeah, but it's but like after after five minutes of conversation. Can you do uh, Gandalf like special pipe, smoke pipe uh, tricks like Gandalf? Yeah, I can blow. Does Gandalf? I can blow does he do smoke rings? rings? I can do rings. What does Gandalf do? Does he do? Tricks? He makes like dragons. Yeah, he makes <laughs> dragons. He can do cool <laughs> shit, dude. Gandalf does tight shit. It Wait, would, does he for real? It would be sick to sesh with Gandalf, dude. <laughs> yeah. It'd be sick to have a, just a real like yeah. real heady sesh with Gandalf. Just. <laughs> See all the smoke. Have tricks. you ever thought about a different universe where <laughs> gay sex is straight <laughs> and straight sex is gay? Sir, sir Ian, please, just yeah. what's on the script, sir? Yeah, just, getting, <laughs> just getting high with Gandalf. No, think about it. It makes more sense, right? <laughs> that guys would fuck guys <laughs> the same rather than guys fucking women. They're different. That's Ian true, McKellen bro. trying to fuck Orlando Bloom yeah. on the set of. <laughs> I'm just saying, it makes sense to me. 
Just oh, wow. Or, or, I've or never like thought of it that way. I'm, I'm too high right now. <laughs> Shut up. Just keep puffing. <laughs> <laughs> just keep hitting. <laughs> Is this just right. weed? <laughs> as long as you just keep speaking, you're not high enough yet, faggot. <laughs> Gandalf, is this just weed? Is this laced with anything? I didn't know you got wet leg loss. <laughs> <laughs> Gandalf lacing his weed with fucking angel dust, uh, GHB, and dick pills. Yeah. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> You wake up, he's just riding your cock. Mm. <laughs> they should put that fucking Hector guy in the Lord of the Rings movies. Which guy? That guy who plays every yeah, Jolo in every movie. Put your shit, uh. get your shit pushed in? <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> you see, a lot of essays say you can't just walk into Mordor. <laughs> it's like the trees that like, team up with the Latinos. <laughs> just in the middle of That would Earth. be so awesome. Yeah, yeah. In the middle of a fantasy, just modern day yeah. Cholos. <laughs> <laughs> You're loco, Legolas. <laughs> But they all are men. My, they yeah. do all have sex with each my other. Little, my little cousin, Spider, he said he could loan you the, the, the sword of, of Chipate. Or, and it's just like a, it's like a butterfly. Knife. <laughs> this is our most respected sword. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would yeah. be good. I've never seen The Lord of the Rings. That seems like an improvement. Dude, they suck. they suck. They suck. Those movies so fucking long. suck. <laughs> I wanted to like them so goddamn. I have tried so many times to sit down and watch. Lord Even the, the fight scenes are good. No, too. they're fucking boring, dude. Damn. They're fucking boring, shitty movies. I just wanted to the, watch the, the fight scenes. The Ralph Bakshi Hobbit is awesome. And when I was a kid, I loved that the cartoon. The cartoon. Yeah. We've yeah. talked about that. I like that. And shit. then, and then when those fucking Lord of the Rings movies came out, I went to like the movie theater. I'm like, this is gonna be great, and it just sucks. It's yeah. Just fucking boring. Uh huh. Do you see any titties? No, right. No. no. Didn't they no. do another one with the dragon? Smog? The Destillation of Smaug? Smaug? <laughs> <laughs> I think that and was they don't one even of the Hobbit prequels. They don't even fight I the dragon I didn't watch any of those. Right? I heard those look terrible because they like shot it on like a super high yeah, frame rate shot, camera. Yeah, they shot some of them at 60 FPS. And everybody's yeah. talking about how like Peter Jackson's this great director or whatever. And it looks like shit. And it's like, no, New Zealand is just pretty. Yeah. Everything else about those movies sucks. Yeah, he shot them all in New Zealand. We yeah. should go to New Zealand, dude. I mean, it, it, like, I how, how fucking, like, how much of a misstep it was to shoot in 60 FPS? It's like, why you would even fucking consider that? Or not even do, like, a like just try it out with one scene <laughs> yeah. and see if anybody <laughs> is like, this is a good idea. Instead, yeah, he, just watch the dailies. He made dude. a piece of media that is permanently fucked that will, like, be just jarring and unsettling. And it, is that the shit that looks, like, plasticky and, like, fat, almost it, like... Well, it's, it's an unnatural... I mean, your eyes have adjusted after a lifetime of watching movies at 24 frames per second to, like, interpreting film that way. And so that looks normal to you. When you shoot something at 60 FPS, the, the motion is too fluid and it gives it that oh, like... Oh, I've seen that shit. That soap opera effect where people... It looks like a daytime soap. Yeah. 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 Which is not shot at that, but it looks like shitty. It doesn't look good. Yeah. TVs do that because all, all like LCDs, they have like frame interpolation where... Because an LCD refreshes it like... The original, like the, the first like generation of like mass consumer panel televisions were around like 60 hertz. So they would, like, the, sc the image on the screen refreshes 60 times per second. And Damn. so b because the source media is only either 24 frames or 30 frames per second, it would interpret, uh, like, interpret two frames and say, okay, this guy's here in this frame, this guy's here in this frame. In between that, we'll put them here. Oh. You know? And that's what creates, like, on, like, flat panel TVs when they came out, like, why they all looked shitty like right. that. Right, it's way where, to change a setting. Yeah, where, like, people would, like, glide across the <laughs> yeah, room. Yeah, 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 You know? I watched, the, like, one of the Terminator reboots in that shit, yeah. and it was one of the worst things right. of all time. For live sports, it's great. You know, if you're watching, like, hockey or something, that shit's, like, cool. Mm -hmm. You know, but for film, it ruins it. Yeah. Because it's, like, just not how you're supposed to be seeing that shit. Yeah. What's some other shit Peter Jackson made? King Kong? Yeah, you made that King Kong. I didn't where see Danny that. It looked like shit. To fuck the monkey. Did she fuck it? No, but they fall in love. How would you fuck a woman if you're King Kong? You, even your finger is too big for her pussy. Mm -hmm. you yeah, well, it's just you. Women just want to be killed. I mean, <laughs> yeah, they want to be crushed by a being honest, giant ape. Yeah, most most women. <laughs> that's, what, that's what chicks like. What women want 
<laughs> is to be killed by man. I don't know that that's true. Are you sure? Yeah, it is, mm-hmm. dude. They're obsessed with like true crime shit. What the that's Me Too true. movement is about is about guys that couldn't actually kill them, uh, sneaking into positions in which they can. Uh-huh. If you just return to... I, I was uh, watching some, some videos on YouTube. <laughs> yeah. that. Let the algorithm take over. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Dude, it's so funny how YouTube. Because like I didn't even I saw those those articles. I was always embarrassed of like because my YouTube's like hooked up to my TV. People would come over and be like, "Oh, let's close the YouTube." Right, right, you know, because right. it's like <laughs> right, right, right. You know, fucking like you know Ben Shapiro rapes <laughs> student. <laughs> you know, and, <laughs> it's, like, and it's yeah. like I wasn't watching that. I don't <laughs> yeah. know, like I don't know why that's in there. And then it turns out, yeah, YouTube was just promoting yeah. all of those it's fucking crazy. videos to everybody. Hmm. So, yeah, we wa- my my roommates. We threw on Bernie on Rogan. Yeah, and now the algorithms fucked. Yeah, off now one Rogan. Just, really? I just listen to a lot of music on YouTube, so it always just suggests yeah, a lot music. of fish. Yeah, the only things I'm live s- nugs. I think I'm subscribed to are uh, 2003. You know, Jay Leno's shit. Garage, and then <laughs> of course that uh, what's his name, Tobias Wendell, the the carpenter, the, car yeah, yeah, the autistic carpenter. Of course. That's good shit. Yeah. Today, I decided to build an entire time machine out of out of <laughs> birch. <laughs> what, a, a lot of people said that it's impossible because with wood, you're not capable of bending the fabric of space-time. <laughs> but I found that if you create a jig for the table saw, <laughs> you can create an impossibly elaborate system of interlocking gears that will bend the very fabric of space-time. <laughs> What I did first is I I, <laughs> I drove the wood home from Home Depot in my homemade wooden truck. <laughs> it's like everything in that guy's life. He's like, instead of just using my regular tools, I decided to recreate them out of wood. <laughs> my parents died five years ago, and I've replaced them with completely autonomous wooden robots. <laughs> Damn. I'm trying to fuck some wood pussy. You'll notice my face is covered in band-aids from my mother kissing me on the <laughs> on the cheek and, and filling my face with splinters because by the time I installed the chip to give her a sense of pain and emotion, it was too late to remove the burrs from her facial features without causing severe pain. So now, to maintain our relationship, I allow her to fill my face with just wood chips and splinters <laughs> because I love her so much. That's okay, so, so we're gonna get some super glue. And we're <laughs> yeah, I don't know, but people people do still use YouTube, which is insane to me. Like YouTubers have like, oh, like watching people's like yeah yeah I vlogging don't know. channels. Yeah, people vlog and they have yeah. like millions of followers. Going to LA is really depressing because you see people like on the street vlogging and <laughs> yeah. stuff. Mm-hmm. I don't see that much in, as much in New York, but nah, dude. Here it's about making fucking money, dude. Yeah. Wall Street and shit like that. Mm-hmm. <coughs> I'm b- yeah, how come you never see homeless people with a sign that says, like, I'm stupid and untalented and I believe too hard in myself? <laughs> yep. I'm s- I bl- blew all my money investing in myself. <laughs> <laughs> well, because anything, most of those people get sex trafficked. Anything will help. No, I mean, like, you know, like fitted cap you, vlog guys. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, I'm just really trying to get my smoothie company off the right, 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 right. Uh, my What's bespoke up? yo-yo company What's failed. What's up, guys? Chad Y2K here. <laughs> I'm 48 years old, and I dress like a toddler. <laughs> I dress like a Midwestern toddler with cancer. <laughs> have you ever dived in on, like, obviously there are, like, a handful of successful mm-hmm. YouTubers, but there have to be millions of failures. Yeah, of course. I've, I, sh- I should watch more of those. Yeah, they're probably not? terrible. I saw a guy that I saw some horrible Scottish comic because I was like looking up Dave. Do you guys remember Dave Schofer from Baltimore? Yeah, yeah. I was looking up some Dave Schofer Uncle interviews, Dave? some Uncle Dave interviews. <laughs> and I think there's a guy named Dave Schofer who's got like 12 views on his shit. It's really some pretty bad comedy. So there's that. But I love just diving into. David Schofer videos, checking uh-huh. him out. That time everyone got his penis. <clears throat> Remember that? He sent a open mic or a dick pic, and then everyone got their hands on it. I don't know if I Do saw Do you ever it. see Dave Schofer's penis? Was it good? No. <laughs> I wouldn't really imagine. He was really little and pink. 
<laughs> I remember one time. <laughs> just stop. <laughs> stop looking at Dave, Dave Sharper's penis. No, it's but he's not my. Pe- he's accidentally looking past his phone <laughs> as his own dick. No. He's like, damn, what? Oh, what? Oh. No, he was one, circumcised. Like the third time I did stand up, it was like at RFD. And Ralph was like, he's like, man, I don't want to make you nervous, but Uncle Dave's in the audience. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I can't. And I was like, <laughs> I wish I, I what got, is that? I got to go that? back and find that email he sent me when I like just didn't want to do a shitty show. <laughs> and I was like, ah, I got a flat tire. And then he like sent me like the stats on what the yeah. donut could do and how far it could go. That was awesome. And I was like, <laughs> you got me. I'm lying. I'm not doing your show. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna come. So <laughs> you found you figured it out. I'm lying to you. <laughs> we both knew I was lying. <laughs> yeah. Just accept the fucking yep. the society. Yeah, <laughs> this is purely <laughs> a courtesy I'm doing to not say fuck you. I don't want to do your dumb shit. Accept it, please. Yeah. Salute yeah. to Uncle Dave. Yeah. Sorry, my mom has mesothelioma. I can't call <laughs> Oh, that's cool, because mesothelioma, you can only get... Oh, yeah, you're right. My mom's fine. Uh, <laughs> I don't yeah. want to drive two hours to perform yeah. for a nine rednecks. In <laughs> Western Maryland. The thing is, though, is like I would do that 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 Westminster show, and that was a good show. That Which was one? fun. That, like, cellar door... Oh, the cellar... No, the cellar door was Frederick. That was, that's a good show. Then maybe, like, two doors down. Yes, that two one. doors down pub. Yeah. I remember that one. Yeah. That was kind of fun. I had a friend that was always trying to get me to move to Westminster with him. <laughs> He's like, dude, you got like... Where's that, by West Virginia? No, it's like by fucking PA. Oh, yeah. damn. It's like, yeah, probably like five minutes from the fucking Pennsylvania border. Uh-huh. In, in what is that, like Carroll, Cecil? Maybe. Carroll County? Yeah. Yeah, it's Carroll County. Something like that. Yeah, Cecil's the... Cecil. Cecil? Cecil County. And is, that's above Kent? I don't know where the fuck Kent is. It's like... So Carroll, then let's power rank the Maryland counties. Well, hold on. It's it's Carroll. Prince George one. <laughs> yeah, you're yeah. PG boy. Hell yeah. <laughs> well, I'm talking about if you, go, if you go across the top of the state, right? Okay. It's Washington, Allegheny, Frederick. Mm-hmm. Oh, you're starting west to east. West to east, yeah. So I'm pretty sure it's Washington, Allegheny, uh, uh, Frederick. That sounds about right. Carroll. But isn't Frederick Southwest? Baltimore. Cease. Is Elkton in Cecil County? No. No? It's in... Um, <clears throat> uh, fuck. What's the one Columbia's in? Isn't Columbia, Elkton? Columbia is actually in three different counties. Really? Columbia is technically in Laurel, Howard, and Montgomery County. I, think. I was thinking of Howard. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, Columbia is tricky. Columbia is tricky. No, you know what? Laurel is in technically in three different counties. Columbia uh-huh. is Columbia is just in Columbia's Howard in County. Howard. That's yeah. right. Yes. Yeah. Laurel's in. Wait, wait. Now I'm confused. <laughs> either either Columbia or Laurel is like technically. It in three seems different counties. like Laurel would be yeah. like in between. Mm-hmm. Laurel's PG. in PG County, Howard County, and Montgomery County. Maybe a piece of Montgomery. Maybe just a little piece yeah, of yeah. Montgomery. Is Laurel a county? No. No, it's just a little it's shitty just, fucking yeah. But, city. I mean, is there also a Laurel County? I don't what think What are the so. counties? It's Allegheny, Washington, <laughs> Carroll, <laughs> Cecil, Howard, Baltimore, Kent, Somerset, Montgomery, Prince George's. Mm-hmm. Uh, Calvert. Calvert. Charles. Charles. <clears throat> Where's St. Mary's in? I think St. Mary's is in either What's Calvert like, or Charles. Yeah. Oh, Isn't you're forgetting some. Waldorf. I'm thinking, because Southern Maryland, I don't fucking know at all. What about Anne Arundel County? Oh, Anne Arundel, yeah, of Anne course. Arundel. Who could forget? How could we forget yeah, the yeah. home of the fucking, the mall and the... the Isn't Fred- it Frederick? You know, uh, uh, Frederick, Frederick we, is Frederick a county. Of course, yeah. obviously, yeah. Frederick. Baltimore City? Is te- city? No, nah, it's not a county. It doesn't work the same way. But it's... it's Baltimore County is like okay, well, a semi do- a circle around fine. it. Fine, who cares? Okay. It doesn't matter. We're just trying <laughs> okay. to list all the counties. All right. Ocean City is in what? Is that Salis- Ocean? Salisbury is... Is that a county? Salisbury no. and Ocean no. City are probably both in... Let's call it Ocean County. Ocean <laughs> County. <laughs> Pacific <laughs> County. Yeah, dude. Southern <laughs> Maryland is like... I don't know. It's like a whole other... Like Ward- La Plata, Waldorf. Worcester. 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 No, Worcester. 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 Somerset. No. Somerset. Lincomico. 
Wicomico, yeah. of course. Yeah. Dorchester. Yep. Dorchester. Dorchester. Talbot. 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 That's another. Tal- we Talbot's forgot up about there. Talbot. Yeah, Talbot. <laughs> That's another one of those Eastern Shore. <laughs> yep. Yeah. <laughs> what else, man? Keep Caroline. Going. Caroline County. Queen Anne's. Uh, I was going to say Queen, Queen Anne's. Anne's. I fucking, I'm like, wait, is Queen Anne's and Anne Arundel the same thing? And I'm no, like, no. I thought no. maybe they renamed it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep going, well, Hold Adam. on. Look at the map, though. Am I right I'm that it's Washington the and then Allegheny, or is it Allegheny and then Washington? Uh, it's Garrett, Allegheny, mm, Washington, Garrett. Frederick, Carroll. The fuck is Garrett County? <laughs> yeah, Garrett is the farthest <laughs> west county. It's right that, by West Virginia, that's right? That's insane. Yeah, yeah, that's all the way at the tip. I don't, I can't. Even recall is that where Cumberland is, Adam? Why don't you look that up? Um, Cumberland's yeah. in Allegheny. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. But Cumberland's towards the end, right? Look it up. Yeah. Is Cumberland in fucking Garrett? <laughs> I know where Cumberland is, but yes, I don't think me I'm too. Hagers, to Hagerstown is. Yeah, Cumberland is in Allegheny. Mm-hmm. Garrett. Uh, it looks like the biggest city there is Oakland. Yeah. Hagerstown mm. is in Washington. Hagerstown is in Washington, of course. Now Hager's finish. Town. What, what else? A, what else? What a forget? weird, what a Shelbyville kind of place. Hager's so you got uh, <laughs> Charles County. You said. Said it. St. Yeah. Mary's County. Yep, said it. Of course. Anne Arundel, Howard, Montgomery. I think we, you got, we them, got all. them all. Yeah. Harford. Oh, Harford. Yeah. yeah. That's where Bel Air Bel-Air is. Yeah, that's yeah. the thing, man. It's like the e- those are easy ones that you should just get immediately. Yeah. So we left out Frederick <laughs> and Harford right away. Harford is easy money. <laughs> I spent some time in Harford. Yeah. That's Shouts out to the color me funny guys. Have her descent. Oh, I forgot about that's that. Where, that's where the Tom Myers recording happened. Yeah. Oh, in Harford Haver County in Bel Air. Yeah. Oh, that should have been the first one you remember. What was the mm-hmm. fucking bar called? It was some Irish bar. Um, sh- I don't remember. Shitty-o- oh, Shitty-o fuckle he's. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shitty-o fucks. <laughs> yeah. Maryland's also the only state that actually, like... All right, now let's do Delaware. We Rehoboth. care about can- counties. And, yeah, Rehoboth, Chester. Dover, Dorchester, <laughs> Dover, um, Newcastle. Mm-hmm. You're naming cities in Delaware. I'm naming anything I can name about Delaware. <laughs> There's no Ian Fidans, Middlesex, Ian Fidans, <laughs> Joe Philly. Biden, Joe Biden. It's so funny that he's Bo from Biden. Delaware. I what know. the fuck is he doing? I know, dude. You're going to try to be for president. You're from Delaware. Did you see that they were like, all right, new plan. We're not going to go out in public that much. Yeah. <laughs> because he, every time he he's at an event, time. he fucks up. It's incredible yeah. how much dementia that motherfucker has. What if there's has. a recession and then he accidentally... Honestly, shout fired. out to Maryland. What a great state. <laughs> Love it, dude. It really is. You think about it. Black you, Eyed Susans. Until you name lacrosse, all the, the counties, you don't. You forget how cakes. much fucking diversity you have in one we got state. Mountains, we, yeah. got you got mountains, we got mountains. You got mountains. Beaches, you got fucking country cities, cities, countries, you got racist rednecks, white people, you got black people, black mm-hmm. people, you got Jews, you got fucking. You do have a ton of Jews. You have fu- anything you want, you can get in Maryland. Name yeah. one thing, Adam. We'll tell you where you can get in Maryland. Uh, <clears throat> pit beef sandwich. Are you kidding me? Yeah, Chaps on. pit beef. Yeah, right there by the fucking gentlemen's that. club, mm-hmm. the Gold Club. It looks like Delaware only has three counties, which I think is humble. Yeah. Fuck Delaware, dude. Fuck Delaware. Fucking piece of shit Fucking place. Good. That's the opposite, too, because people are like, oh, Maryland, Delaware, they're very similar. No, Fuck because off. Delaware has nothing. Nothing. They have nothing. It's, they have no taxes. They hold you right? hostage. You have to pay a toll to get out of their dumbass state. They have yeah, no and they're tax. fucking hot. It's also Delaware is just a speed trap on the way to Philly. I-95 yep. That's all it is. sucks on Delaware. It's the fucking worst. Fuck Delaware, dude. Do they go down to two lanes when you get to Delaware? Yes. Yeah, and then they fucking they, 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 they <laughs> yeah. fucking arrest you for a hate crime if you drive uh, sixty-seven miles per hour. Mm-hmm. Ugh. All right, you want to talk more about the Eastern Seaboard? Tell me, you want to see what? I'll tell you where you can get anything from Maryland. Go ahead, man. You know what it is? Uh, it's Jersey without Italians. That's what makes Maryland great. Yeah. There's, not a, there's no fuck. You don't. Have there's to deal no with Italians. Them. You do not have to deal with them. There are such a little minority that we can all tell them to shut you the just, fuck up. Is there a little off. Italy in Baltimore? There is. Yeah. What is it? A just strip a bunch ball? of old motherfuckers playing bocce downtown in a weird neighborhood that no one else lives in. It's like between the. It's like next to the Inner Harbor. Is it a nice neighborhood? It's kind of nice, but it's it's. Um, uh, Should we gentrify? All their around it is abandoned. And they yeah. won't, because Italians won't sell. They won't sell. They just fucking stick around. They're going to die there. <clears throat> There's a couple okay Italian restaurants, but yeah, Little Italy in Baltimore sucks dick. Is there a Chinatown Baltimore? There is not a Chinatown, but there is, uh, if you go to uh, in Catonsville, Autopsy finds Korean bro- stuff. Finds broken bones in Jeffrey Epstein's <laughs> neck. Oh, yeah. Deepening questions around his death. 
That's awesome, dude. They say that it could be from a hanging, but more likely a strang- strangulation. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they are just straight up going to be like, yeah, no, it's no big deal. He killed himself. Anyway. He strangled himself. Yeah. But didn't haven't people said that you can't hang yourself in those cells? You can, dude. You, you can. You, you, wire taught me that, that you can kill yourself by sitting down. Yep, with the How belt. How do you do that? The you put a belt around you know, the belt. Yeah, he just sat down. You don't remember like, that? I remember, I remember seeing that scene. Spoilers. I was like, damn, really? I That's know. nice. Cool idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Space-saving suicide techniques. Yeah. Are you trying to commit suicide in a hotel room? In a closet. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, if you kill yourself, you're not allowed to be black anymore. That's the point of that scene. <laughs> <laughs> they take it away from you. That's the punishment. You get buried as if a white If you're Catholic, man? you go to hell. But if you're black and you kill yourself, guess what? Now you're white. That would seem like... Take that. Yeah. You would be lame. Yeah. In the afterlife, or do you get reincarnated as a white man? You get reincarnated as one of the white chicks. <laughs> but you look oh. like Sean and Marlon in that I love, movie. I love that they made that movie, and they like they didn't test the makeup, and they were like, this doesn't work. They were like, this doesn't... Similar no. to the Peter nah, Jackson... No, but it does six, work, though. It doesn't. They look... <laughs> They look insane. That's look part like of what's <laughs> crazy about it is that everyone's just going along with this incredibly fucking stupid thing. Yeah. I love it. Oh, one of those girls who I believe the original one that they body switch with was also in Boy Meets World, and now she's doing hardcore pornography on Blacked.com. Yeah. Who? I don't know her name, but I have jacked off from to the. Her. Sh- she was the redhead Whitefish? from Boy Meets World, the college years. Oh, she okay. was um she was uh yeah, the that, brother. The college years pissed me off cuz Topanga Topanga got what? Too, she got too big. She got too chunky. Yeah, no, I liked thick Topanga, dude. No, I liked her in high school. Oh, you liked her as a child, you I like fucking nubile, pedophile. Nubile Topanga. I, like I was a child too. No, you weren't. Yes, I was. You were just watching it when I picked you up. I wasn't watching it today. You were watching the pilot episode of Boy Meets World when they were nine years old. And you were getting horny for Topanga. Um yeah, yeah. that redhead that's a tip for all the Come Town fans oh, damn, out there. Yeah, that this girl. Yep. She's she got a does. couple scenes on blacked right now. So I'm sorry if you're one of oh, our like ra- many older, racist she's fans. She's an older lady. She's got some big old things. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Sorry, this is white genocide. I, if hope, you're the new, I hope the new Modern Warfare is in fucking complete garbage. I, I saw the ch- gameplay trailer and it looked like just absolute shit. And it made me want to kill myself. <laughs> and if it's... I, re- <laughs> I mean it, dude. I, I believe you, man. I just, like, I need it. You need be, it. I need it to be you good. Went, you had Red Dead for a while. Then well, there was a there was a sp- Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 was the pinnacle of fucking gaming. Mm-hmm. That's like that was it. That was the game. Nothing. Adam, you said you had a friend that had to drop out of college because of Well, this. he had to repeat a year. <laughs> Danny had to repeat a year because of Call of Duty. It's, Salute. It was he murked too much. It was <laughs> fucking it was perfect, dude. And it like it was so addicting. Yeah. I would fucking wake up at 3 p.m. Get like a six pack and some tacos from next to my apartment. Sounds pretty tight. And then actually. I would play Call of Duty Modern Warfare until it was time to lift weights. <laughs> and then I would go do that. <laughs> and then I would go back and continue drinking and playing that game until 6 a.m. And then pass out. <laughs> and that was my life every day <laughs> for like seven months. <laughs> And then that is, that is it. <laughs> I would do a spot here. I would like feature a Cap City like once a month. <laughs> Maybe I go to Villian and feature there, but I did just not, be playing Call of Duty I in your brain. How did fucking, you afford that? You didn't have a, you had that day job. I or? I would teach defensive driving. I well I also like tempt for a while right, too. Right, right. So I would do temp jo- jobs here, and then uh, Joe Stats was the apartment manager. So, gotcha. So he would anytime like. Somebody moved in. He would give me half off rent and say I referred them. So my rent was like often three hundred dollars a month, <laughs> Hell yes. which was paid for by teaching defensive driving once. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then uh, prior to that, so I, you had to work a total of maybe four days a week, a month. Yeah, to to afford that lifestyle. Barely, barely anything. And then I would like temp when I did have that temp job that lasted like a month, and it was they were paying me like fifteen or twenty Damn, an hour. That sounds awesome. Yeah, dude. and there's no income tax in Texas, so it was like uh, living in Texas was a joke. If you made like I, like uh, you make like seventeen to twenty k a year. 
your rent at the time, you know, 10 years ago, it was like nothing. Yeah, Austin's yeah. expensive now, right? Yeah, now. I and mean, also, like, prior to that, I lived with, like, Chris for a year, and he, uh, like, he would pay me the rent in cash, which I would never spend. So I just had, like, cash on hand from, like, the other half of the rent. Right. And on top, like, I was working at home and making, like, I think, like, 13 an hour. Nice. And, yeah, so I had zero. So, yeah, you had time to I had, like, zero expenses, yeah. At that point, when I moved into that apartment, I had something, like, I think, like, seven grand saved or something. Yeah. And I was like, I'm going to focus on comedy. And I just <laughs> <laughs> did not. And you have. just yeah. played Call of Duty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah, dude. Yeah. Fuck, I miss that shit. I can't wait to just quit, give up on life completely. Yeah. And just do that again. That's mm. going to be reti- that's what retirement homes are going to look like for our generation. Yeah. It'll just be a bunch of old fat motherfuckers getting fucked up and playing Gaming. games. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I the can't. best actually not that it was that and then what I used to love is when I when I did work at home at the call center, I would bring the phone out into the living room. And I would just get drunk and play uh, Lego Indiana Jones <laughs> while, while on the phone with customers. <laughs> you can play that drunk for sure. Oh, yeah. No, that's, that's the only game I could play when I worked at the call center because you can't lose. Yeah, it's, it's for babies. No, it's literally for babies. <laughs> yeah. So I would just get really drunk and high, and they'd be like, my email doesn't work. I'd be like, hang on. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> oh, sorry. I was trying to figure something out on your account. And I'm like just making a Lego guy put like a... A purple Lego on top. <laughs> the unlock some kind of Egyptian puzzle. <laughs> Massive respect. Yeah. I used to play Snood at my telemarketing job. That was my that was how I would game. You guys fuck with Snood? Uh what's that? That's like a you shoot like you a shoot ball. Shoot a little ball. Yeah, yeah. I, I played that shit. <laughs> yeah. Uh I salute love to American government mortgage. My former place of employment that definitely, definitely aided the fucking mortgage the crisis. recession, yeah. 100%. The Great Recession. My boss, Doug, used to show us his nuts all the time <laughs> and talk about cheating on his wife. Pretty, pretty chill dude. He talked about it with everyone? Did she ever find out? I don't know. I don't think so. He said he got head while his dick was soft on the beach at Ocean City. <laughs> 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 he claimed to have like gotten sucked off from one of those Ukrainian teenagers. Nice. <clears throat> and that he couldn't stay hard. Nice. Is and that a thing in Ocean City? There are Ukrainian teenagers that oh, suck yeah. you off? That's yeah. it, the whole place is staffed by like sex trafficked fucking Ukrainian. Oh, they're all like seasonal employees. Yeah, they're like, Welcome to M M R Docs. I we have shirt to sell you, please don't fuck my ass. <laughs> Please don't ask I my lo- manager lo- to fuck me ass. I love to come from Ukraine to sell to sell hermit crab to to drunk uh, the rapist from Pennsylvania <laughs> to uh, rapist bros from Pennsylvania. <laughs> there are thirty five of them stacked into a suburban, and they come here to rape me <laughs> from Allentown. A a t- a. T- uh, the entire Chevy Suburban filled with rapists from Allentown <laughs> is on their way to have spring break in my ass. <laughs> Damn, dude. Oh, we got to play gross. a cum fest, dude. Off season. And secrets. When should we do it? February? Mm. My birthday weekend, dude? Yeah. This is like, it was <laughs> terrible cum weather. Cum secrets. New York Magazine interviewed Jeffrey Epstein's bodyguard. Oh, shit. Oh, I saw that. Yeah. What did he say? And I... <laughs> we'll always love you. Damn, my man's talking on the record. Yeah. I would be scared if I was him. Igor Zinoviev. I was sex trafficked from Russia. <laughs> my sister was. No. Me and my sister were shipped to Ocean City. Yeah. To Doughboy's Pizza. Mm hmm. What did Mr. Gishkinarvnyev say? Uh, Anything I'm, good? I mean, I'm, this is an article I haven't. Adam's doing his Adam? own thing. I'm reading about. I'm reading about uh, about Epstein as well. What do we got? Well, TMZ is saying that Epstein either hurled himself off the top bunk or had his feet to the ground and leaned forward to cut off his air supply. What? 
I think that they think that he hurled himself off the top bunk. Oh, is that other going to try and explain why the neck, his neck bones were broken? Yeah. Didn't they also, didn't someone also say they heard shrieking? Yeah. <laughs> from his jail? You can't shriek while you hang yourself, no? I don't know. What if he was like, I'm killing myself? They say Jeffrey Epstein's blood vessels in his eyes popped when the air supply was cut off by the bed sheet that was wrapped around his neck. What if he did kill himself, but it was like The Godfather 2, where they were like, come on, man, do the right thing. Like Bill and Hillary were like, they, oh, brought, yeah. his, they brought his, they brought his they brought pedophile his cousin from, from Israel. Israel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And they're like, Joe, hmm. you, have to, you have to take one for the cabal. I guess his bodyguard is Russian, so you know every liberal now is like, well, Trump is... It's, it's collusion. It's the Russians. <laughs> God. God damn! You should you should kill yourself if you. Think. It's gonna be so awesome when it's Joe Biden mm. versus Trump in a dementia off. Yeah, <laughs> just like, <laughs> and Trump is just flustering Biden's dumbass. Who did Biden? Do? He debated Sarah Palin. Yeah, and then also who's that other fucking idiot that ran with Romney? Paul Ryan was that him? Oh, yeah. That Paul Ryan loser. ran for vice president. And he got worked by Biden, I think. This interview is... I don't know why they published it. This is just some Russian guy. And so these are the questions. By this time, you had stopped competing as an MMA fighter? Not really, actually. You were still competing? Yes, maybe I stopped already. Maybe I stopped already. Uh, <laughs> Virgin Islands in Palm Beach, it was, I started working in Palm Beach. I would see him only when, um, uh, where the fuck is it? Uh, and when he has to go to big jail, actually. <laughs> <laughs> it is verbatim. Does what he they, say big? Yeah. Wait, but, what you just said is what is written. This is verbatim what is written in the New York magazine. <laughs> yes, maybe I stopped already. Maybe I stopped already. I yeah, was in the Virgin Islands in Palm Beach. It was, uh, I started working in Palm Beach. I would see him only when, uh, where the fuck is it? Uh, <laughs> When he has to go to big jail, actually. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's when he was at Palm Beach the first time. I started before working with him in New York and Virgin Islands. You were in New York also? Yeah. You drove him in all three places. In New York, I didn't drive him. In New York, he had a driver, whatever his name was. He was like old family. I just trained with him in New York and traveled with him. And I just drove him here in Palm Beach because other place he had different driver. They're just personnel, you know, to just drive him. Somebody drive him in New Mexico. Somebody drive him in Virgin Islands, actually. <laughs> I just drove him here in Palm Beach. <laughs> you went with him to all the other properties? Did you go with him to New Mexico also? Yeah. You worked with him and traveled with him 24-7, so that means you were on his plane, correct? Yeah. You lived in his guest house? Yeah. You lived alone in the guest house? Of course. In Palm Beach, when we stay at Palm Beach, we have a guest house, and there's a property manager who lived there. He was working there before me. It was a Polish guy. Yeah. <laughs> He's a Polish guy. Did he have bodyguard abilities like you? No. You were introduced to Epstein by a middleman, so how was it when you first met him? Pretty good. I never heard anything from him. Let's say it was improper, rude or something. He's always polite. Always nice person, basically, always smiling. <laughs> Always smiling. Yeah. Is he just got his dick sucked by a 12 year old? He was always in a great mood. Yeah. This is just this is ridiculous. What did you teach him? Basic workout, lift weights, and a little practice, some self defense. Like boxing, kicking. <laughs> was he a good <laughs> athlete? He's in pretty good shape. That's like, we got an exclusive <laughs> interview with Jeffrey Epstein's chef. And then they're like, what about peanut butter and jelly sandwiches? Like, I, that's, it's a sandwich that has a peanut butter and jelly on it. Uh, and Jeffrey liked to eat these. So, yes, he would have uh, sometimes uh, for lunch uh, maybe, uh, but uh, not dinner so much. Uh, you have uh, different uh, different meals, you see. It's a uh, breakfast, it's uh, uh, eggs, and uh, lunchtime usually a sandwich, and then dinner it's like a spaghetti meatball or maybe a piece of grilled fish. <laughs> They're like, wow, earth shattering, earth shattering interview with a man who made lunch. <laughs> There's fucking nothing in now, there. Now, Mr. Epstein, video. has he ever heard of spaghetti? Yeah. There's a video from like Inside Edition or something of a girl that was like, I think she was a flight attendant on the Lolita Express. Damn. And or she's a woman, <laughs> whatever. And did she you, said, wait, that hold on, shut up, uh, real quick. Er, did he ever talk about his case? Why was he in trouble? No, he never talked about that stuff. He never talked about any of that stuff. No. Really? No. <laughs> yeah. Exclusive. We have nothing. <laughs> Why did this guy even go on the record? 
Did he even know he was on the record? I don't know. It says, like, uh, whoever wrote this says that they interviewed him in 2015 when they were at the Daily Beast, and now he's recanting everything he said. Oh. So in our conversation in 2015, he describes his relationship with teenage girlfriends. So many times I tried to stop him. I tried to tell him my opinion about that. He didn't listen to me. That's the reason why I'm not working for him no more. I make him do that to let me go. Do you remember saying that? And he says... It's not the teenage girls. I never see the teenage girls. I tell you, I never see teenage girls. Plenty of time when I work for him, I never see anything on proper teenage girls around him. That's what they say. My man is trying not to get got right now, dude. I think it's just like, you know, yeah, it could lower his profile. So now you say only when you saw him. You know, it's funny, too, is like liberals go after Russia, and it's like Russians just lie. <laughs> but oh, yeah. you have to like understand that's just like a part of their culture. Right. Mm-hmm. It's not a part of our culture. We're supposed to have integrity. Mm-hmm. So people like the Clintons or whoever who are lying, corrupt pieces of shit, it's worse than when fucking Putin does it because Putin's just doing what he knows of how to course. do. All of the poo- people Putin has killed, it's, that- it's like if you were able to save them and bring them to America... Within a month, they'd be committing insurance fraud. Mm-hmm. That's, <laughs> That's right. just, that is just what they know. It's that thing about the scorpion and the monkey, or whatever. The it's fuck. the scorpion and the <laughs> it's monkey. It's the scorpion and the monkey, a classic <laughs> scorpion and <laughs> the monkey, <laughs> where he stings him at the end, or whatever. Where the scorpion stings the monkey. <laughs> Or, like, no. Come on, come on a, brother. <laughs> no, no, no. It's, that's not uh, what the oh. monkey sounds like. <laughs> <laughs> oh. The monkey sounds different. <laughs> I, uh, maybe I've confused it. <laughs> come on, man. No, no, no. You that's my the scorpion. Head. That's what the scorpion sounds oh. like. Oh. For some reason, I get. No, uh, not even him. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely not the monkey, though. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, there's a, there's a video my friend sent yeah. me. Here's another thing you said to me last time about Epstein, the girls you saw at his house, specifically about moments when you're trying to offer him advice about his conduct. Sometimes he tries to make joke. He'd say, thank you, Grandma. I don't need your opinion. So, like, when the Russian guy was like, you need to stop having sex with kids, Jeffrey. <laughs> he's like, yeah, okay, Grandpa. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, dude. Yeah. Epstein really was on a hot winning streak. <laughs> if you're a pedophile, dude, you're just like, okay, man, I'm going to be okay, actually. Yeah. He's the best, dude. He had a hot, I mean. He was going for that Larry Nasser uh, record. Damn. Nasser's in jail, right? That's yeah. what happens when you're a solo pedophile. You get to spend your, the rest of your days getting raped in prison. Nasser's definitely getting raped. <laughs> Nasser's getting his whole absolutely worked over, and he deserves it, if you ask me. Yeah. <clears throat> it's called justice. Scorpion and the monkey style. What were you saying, Adam? Oh, yeah, there's... Well, oh, yeah, that inside edition thing. There's a girl, this woman who's oh, yeah, like, the yeah, I worked, on the, I worked on the flight attendant, I'm, or I worked on the plane as, as a flight attendant. I met Bill Clinton a bunch of times, and he was great. Like, we went... We... Uh, we I... I worked on that trip to Africa with him, and he uh, took me shopping <laughs> and asked me to pick out a gift for uh, Chelsea. And when he uh, when we were on the plane, he liked to ask oh. me to make sh- to make uh, <laughs> peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. And so for some reason, the flight attendant or the, the producer gave her a, two pieces of bread and peanut butter and jelly. And at, like, the end of the news item, she's, like, making the peanut butter and jelly sandwich <laughs> to, like, recreate making <laughs> Bill Clinton a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. It's the most insane thing in the world. It was like, yeah. what were those producers from fucking Inside well, Edition Well, this proves thinking? it. She's not, she's not lying. Yeah, it's like, w- like, if you give them enough of a story, they don't know what to do with it. Yeah. You like, know. was she fucking Bill Clinton? Uh, may- maybe it seems like it, it right? sounds like it. But let's check. But why back. they say like, can you make one of those? Yeah, <laughs> Checking back in on Igor, it's like uh, the reporter is. This is mostly this reporter arguing with him that he said or didn't right, say right, something right. in 2015. So then now they're saying it's exactly what you said. I can send it to you. Here's something else you said. It could be tricky, you know. Normally he always checks his newspaper. It's nothing about me. I say no. He say they forget about me. And when I mentioned Epstein was being exposed for teenage girls. You said, or sorry, and when I mentioned Epstein was being exposed for messing with teenage girls, you said, I'm not surprised at all. I'm just surprised how long he can be outside the real world. Someday, <laughs> it's going to call him, and it's going to be real jail. You have so much money, you can pay it off. Me personally, if I caught him doing something with my daughter or something like that, I'm not going to go to police. I'll do something else. Much worse. 
<laughs> that guy could try to sue me and manipulate the situation with his money. That's the American way. I know he screwed up a lot of fashion girls also. That's a different story. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> he laughs. He laughs, yeah. <laughs> Do you remember saying that? I remember said one thing like, if I be the father and somebody screwed up my daughter, I don't give a shit how much money I have. I definitely do some bad thing. That's what I said. Before that stuff, I don't... <laughs> he's like, don't let know. me be on the record. I yeah. will murder anyone yeah. who fucks my daughter. That's, that's <laughs> why he's fucking walking this back because he told this reporter he would kill Jeffrey Epstein. <laughs> Oh, right, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Igor, I'm not making this stuff up. I was very careful. And he says, I'm really careful, too. <laughs> <laughs> right back at you, pal. Yeah. Also, if you're also, this reporter... Also, fuck this reporter. Exactly. Yeah. Why are you trying to fucking literally endanger this because, motherfucker's because life? Because here's the thing. All journalists are fucking sociopaths, and they only care about their own glory. Uh-huh. Right. You know, so... Yeah, yeah it's, he's not, like, yeah. we're uncovering any truth. Everyone knows Epstein's a fucking pedophile. Yeah. All you're doing is just making this man's life more dangerous. Yeah. Reporters will endanger and slander whoever they need to to get their story across. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, fuck them, dude. Unless they, work at, the unless they work at reason, in which case they're just autistic. Yeah. Those are the only people. Those or only arguing people. for no um, age of consent laws. Well, that's because they're autistic. Right. And they're like, well, if you think about the numbers, <laughs> it's like, you have to think about the people. And they're like, I don't understand. Ah, <laughs> uh, fuck, dude. The rest, of them are, the rest of them are a symptom of sociopathy. The reason ones are a symptom of autism. Mm. Beautiful. Yeah. It's the monkey and the scorpion. <laughs> the monkey. Classic like, man, don't be monkey writing. <laughs> no, no, no. What you be writing about? No. I tried. To, I no. told you that in confidence. That's not. And the scorpion's what the like, it's not my like. fault. I had uh, autism. <laughs> why? Why are you doing that? Actually, I'm. That's what it, I'm just. That doing. one's that's fine. To differentiate the characters. <laughs> that one's fine. If I was, I wouldn't have do. Hey, I'm a monkey. monkey hey, scorpion. I'm, I don't think I see it. Yeah, that's because you you're know, not looking in the right place. You're not looking in the right. You got to read between the lines. ASAP. 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 Rocky's fables. A sop, a snap, a snap, a sucks fables. There's there's one from a website called hecticdad.com. What's it about? The scorpion and the monkey. Yeah. Shut up, dude. Shut your bitch ass. But this man. is like this is the him getting into a fight with the reporter now. I realize others tried to talk to you. Others tried to talk to you. Um uh, did anybody off? Did he ever offer you money? Did anybody try to silence you? He says no. Epstein I never tried to give you money. I wonder what he was capable of doing since he settled a lot of lawsuits. And then he says nobody ever wanted to offer me money. I don't care about money. I want everybody to just leave me alone. Just one thing: when somebody from newspapers write and from everywhere call you me Red Army fucking commando, what's that mean exactly? Yeah, so this report is like, hey, this Russian guy that's just trying to earn a fucking living driving around the fucking pedophile. <laughs> yeah. Let's, bring, let's drag living. him back into the spotlight. Yeah. And, yeah. I mean, it works. We're reading this shit. I, I would click on this shit. Yeah. I'm clicking on all the Epstein shit, dude. Mm-hmm. This, is, this guy's Vigo in fucking Eastern Promises. Yes, he really is, dude. Yeah. They're about to make him go back to the old him. Yeah. Yeah, I love that picture. <laughs> yeah, the Bugs Bunny. Yeah, Bugs. <laughs> yeah. I love that meme. So I was talking about that the other day. I love it so much. <laughs> Igor's about to kill this journalist, dude. And he would deserve it. Yeah. If you ask me. Listen, what you say is between you and me. Like, this guy, like, look at the, the Russian guy publishing. It's saying this. Listen, what you say is between you and me. And then they publish that. You have a history at this point. One night you told me, for instance, That's one thing you told me is he got a heads up when the authorities were going to come to his house the night before. You told me we get phone calls the night before at eight o'clock. The police. Why? Are going to why come. you? Exp- yeah. What's the expose? You told me here? that, Igor. Want me to read the quote? Well, you can read whatever you want right now. Just don't. You can put yourself in big trouble. You said he will always do something wrong. There were some nights in question. See, it's funny. It's because like, if this journalist got murdered for doing this, it'd be like. He told you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he told you you're putting yourself in trouble. Because this isn't a pedophile. This is just a Russian person. Yes. Which we have, you know, mm-hmm. which we have all agreed are, yeah. by their nature, sneaky. I think it's, it's really time for the West to lose control of the narrative completely. Mm-hmm. You know? 
So you're thinking uh, Eastern a Russian, philosophy, Chinese, more of like yeah, an Orthodox, mm-hmm. you know, was, was still Christian, but Greek Orthodoxy. I'm ready. Yeah. I'm baptized. Just sort of like an Eastern yeah. Eastern Orthodox authoritarian regime <laughs> that rolls in and kills everyone. And okay. Then we all become Russian liars. Yeah, that's. I would. Yeah. I would like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I, I, You'd I like to dive back into that? We keep Greg Proops in a prison. We keep Greg Proops in a prison where he gets to comment on everything but above a dunk tank. <laughs> okay. Yeah, <laughs> yeah corruption? Uh, no thank you. <laughs> and then just, he's uh, uh, a fire hose filled with piss hoses him down. <laughs> <laughs> you think the Russians would beat the Chinese, yeah. though? Corruption train? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, the the Chinese would beat the Russians. I think the Chinese got Russia, the upper hand. Russians is a, is a is a lazy drunk country. They're chaotic. They're too much chaos. Yeah, China will like let millions of people die. Just so to will Russia will too, but they're not as organized about it. They used to. Mm-hmm. You know, WW two. They did. I that. don't know, man. Russians are dangerous. It's like, what if Asians were white? <laughs> <laughs> that's what. You know? That's what Patton said. Damn, dude, when you Russians, put it in that man. I've heard Russians say that themselves. Yeah. That's yeah. why Chechens are the fucking worst, because it's like, it's what, like yeah. what if Asians were white, and but Muslim. what if they were Muslim? Yeah. yeah. Those motherfuckers are tough, I will yeah. say. Mm-hmm. Yeah, their national they, sport is MMA. They love dying. They love They it. love being killed by <laughs> the government. Damn, dude. Fuck. Yeah, this is great. Um, I'm telling you to give you a chance to remember because we talked about this stuff. I know it's hard. I don't know what you mean by put myself in trouble. Let that go. Seriously, let that go. <laughs> Why is it so important? Are you worried about the local cops? Listen, you're really smart, and I'm not going to offer that over the phone right now, okay? Oh, my God. Jesus you're really Christ. smart. He's like, <laughs> you have no idea. Please. Jesus what Christ. do you mean by that? I can't explain you. I can't explain over the phone any oh of this. Oh, my God. This is fucking, what is it, Naomi Watts being like, but what happened to the baby? And Vigo being like, you need to drop it. <laughs> I'm just driver. You need. To, <laughs> you really need to drop it. I just drive car. That movie is so good. I love that fucking movie, dude. It's so fucking good. You Ugh. said that last time, and we didn't talk for years. You can tell the world who this guy was. You were with him for a long time. You know what I mean? I totally understand. You think he had could have had help committing suicide. First of all, I have to go right now. I have another client. Still training people? Yes, but just be careful. I'm not kidding. So what's wow. your email so I can send you? Don't do any kind of that stuff. Just don't play seriously. Can you tell me why? I can't. I can't. And maybe I ask you just one more question. Just go ahead. Have you been talking with anyone in the government, the FBI? Have they come to you? Long pause. Great talking to you. Seriously. <laughs> we talk later. <laughs> Yo, wow. f- honestly, fuck this reporter, dude. Yeah. He comes off like such a dumb asshole. Mm. Here's from another thing from New York Magazine. How Moscow Mitch is helping the Democrats. Oh, my fucking God. Dude. What is the point? Why are they calling him Moscow Mitch? I don't know, man. The world is so gay. <laughs> Epstein owned the painting of Bill Clinton in the That was dress. actually pretty funny. I mean, so what? In the dress? It's like... It's funny. That's I guess. A, it's a thing, but it's like normal people look at this like, what could that mean? There has to be some it doesn't explanation. Mean anything. It's like he has sex with children. This was his weird sex friend. They're all fucking children together. It's like how many how much more do you need? Yeah, they're boys. How much more <clears throat> do you need to understand that your problematic fave oh, is that a is so global true. pedophile? I am so beyond the fact of finding that weird yeah the the fact that some people are like what do you mean like they would be bizarre if the if you didn't think the president was a pedophile yeah (laughs) for him to pop up in a pedophile they're like well actually trump is a pedophile it's like okay they're both yeah yeah so many of them are pedophiles yeah who was that? F- the other motherfucker? Well, but the it's speaker like, of the house was a pedophile forever. The Republican, yeah, yeah has- Hastert, yeah. right? It, but it's like it's really it's like it's like you're living in a world with people that are convinced that Santa Claus is real, <laughs> you know, and they're like, but le- we left the cookies out and no one ate them. I'm yeah. like, yeah, Santa Claus isn't real. They're like, but isn't it weird that the cookies weren't eaten? And Usually like, he eats them every year. No. There is no Santa Claus. That's your parents like, eating the right, cookies. Yeah, it's like, but there's presents here, and it's like, yes, they give you those <laughs> presents so that you shut up. Yeah, it's not 
Like, uh, like we left out the children and nobody fucked them. Right. It's like, like we, like the the level to get to is the one where you're like, the world is run by fucked up people and there's nothing you can do about it. Right. Mm -hmm. And they like, it's pretty easy to arrive to that point. But it's like there's so many people that just struggle with the first step of just being like, yes, it's fucked. <laughs> like it's yeah, like, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. deeply fucked yeah, up. Yeah, we're fucked. Yeah. It's fucked. Let's just hope. That's why we got to. That's why it's we like, can that's get what I'm to, saying, man. The, the new modern the warfare has to back. be good. Yeah. <laughs> it like it really fucking has to be good because that is what's important. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean it. It's this whole system set up. You know, it's like the fucking like the Matrix or whatever. Uh -huh. where, where you're Joey Pantoliano I am right Joey now. Joey Pants, you know. And, and the I'm stake like, is modern warfare. Yeah, and I'm like, I want to be somebody uh, important, like an actor, you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I don't want to remember nothing. You understand me? <laughs> nothing. <laughs> And that's what I mean by Luigi's Mansion 3 better be great. <laughs> <laughs> you heard it here, folks. I got to go to the city. For what? Adam's got his pussy doctor. I got to go see my, my gynecologist. <laughs> <laughs> Adam and <laughs> yeah. Do Adam Greeks? on all fours in stirrups with his asshole out. <laughs> Is it like a gynecologist if it's Greek? <laughs> Do you call it that? A he does dick and asshole. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's, that's yeah, good. Yeah. Two in one. Yeah. He does proctology as well. Mm -hmm. Come see Funny Moms uh, this Monday and next Monday. Come to Fat Tuesdays at the stand every Tuesday. The 19th is this Monday. Funny Moms and then the 26th. 26. And then see me the 29th in L.A. Mm -hmm. and then at the Lodge Room. And then come to uh, the Bay Area. I'm in Oakland on the 24th. And I'm in Seattle on the 29th and Portland on the 30th. And come dot town to buy shirts. And I'm doing Philly... It, on the 21st of September, fresh off the plane from Greece, and then I'm doing uh, some dates in Indiana, and I'm trying to get Louisville in there, so I haven't announced that one yet, but I'm hoping. But, yes, buy our shirts, come to our shows, give Adam head. Thank you. Bye, everyone. Later.